Hey y'all, I'm here in the kitchen baking my muffins. Um, okay. Today is Tuesday night, latish night style. And some changes are going to happen to the blog. I'm having some blog fatigue. I was thinking about taking a break. But I realized that's not really what I want to do. What I really want to do is um, go back to blogging in a way I did when I started, which was not blogging for the reader, but blogging more for myself. And uh, so that may mean that I don't blog seven times a day, or even every day. I'm hoping it will mean that when I do blog, it'll be back to a funnier post style. And, um, you know, I've kind of been wanting to do this for a while, but I've gotten so, I don't know, paranoid about losing readers or whatever. I mean, it's just so silly and dumb. And I realize now, like, I don't, nothing I can do. I can't control that. If you enjoy reading, like, I hope you come back. I really have enjoyed the community. Um, sorry. <gasps> sorry about that. Um, I really have enjoyed the community, honestly, people. Um, and all of your comments, and it has been... Um, probably one of the most life-changing experiences um, I've ever had, and um, fantastic and greater than anything I ever could have imagined it would be, sincerely, sincerely. Um, truly, my life is so different now than it was when I started, not even that long ago, people, just started this in July, end of July, and, um, but lately, I feel pressure to um, write something, even though I don't have anything to say. And it's kind of become something that's annoying sometimes, or stressful, or just not authentic to um, what's really going on for me. Not that I'm lying or faking anything, but, um, you know, I've kind of started to just like feel like I gotta have topics of conversation that will engage all the different kinds of readers that I have and um, I think what really was engaging to people was the more authentic version of myself and not this so um, I'm gonna do that and it might take me a couple of weeks to transition back to normal and it might mean that I am not blogging for a week or so while I try to get back to myself, or it might mean that I'm blogging 20 times a day like a maniac. Who knows? Who knows what's going to happen? But um, I definitely want to get back to my normal self, and, you know, I have definitely changed myself to suit the reader, and you can look for my swearing to come back, pronto style. Um, I started censoring myself and um, trying to write with consideration of different people's sensibilities or, you know, who I know in real life who might be reading now, and that's really taken a lot of the pleasure out of it for me. So, um, I'm cutting that, cutting that stuff out, going back to the old ways. And also, you know, when I started this, I wasn't, I did not expect to have this kind of a readership, number one. Number two, um, I was actively losing weight, and it was like, you know, something to talk about. And I don't really have something else that I'm that passionate about. I've been trying to have finances be that passionate for me. It's not, I'm not feeling it. It's not working. And also, I think that's a little something different than like, you can say you want to lose weight and people are like, great. But when you say you're trying to get your finances in control, people start getting a little bit too personal or judgmental. And I'm not comfortable with it. So, out the door with that. Um, not that I'm not going to be doing that, and maybe I'll have ways to talk about it that are funnier than, you know, I don't know. Uh, Self-disclosing the way that I have been trying to do that. I don't know. I'm, I'm not feeling that topic. Um, 
And I also just felt a little bit like, I don't know, like I'm just, I guess I'm feeling at this point, just feeling so overexposed that it's draining. And, um, you know, not that I don't have things to say every day, but I find myself, it's just so complicated. I mean, I'm sure a lot of you know exactly what I'm talking about. I've seen a lot of people lately have been feeling a little blog fatigue. And some of it I think is seasonal, that like, you know, it's time to go outside. I don't want to be sitting inside anymore. I don't go to an office where I'm inside at my computer every day, so it's not like I've, I'm there anyway. I think that would be different. I have to like make the conscious choice to do that. Also, other on other fronts, which maybe I'm blogging on. Um, oh, no, you're looking at my kitchen now. It's not clean from after dinner, but um, I've been keeping the house really, really clean. And if you've noticed, I've been a little less present on the blog. And you know what? It's like, I can't do everything, folks, and I'm happier with the house clean. So, you know, I gotta, I gotta make my choices. And, um, and anyway, it's spring. I want to go outside. It's just, you know, I've got other conflicts. I realized, you know, I haven't like read a book for seven months because I've been so busy blogging and I've kind of given up a lot of things that I actually enjoyed and added added value and relaxation to my life in order to maintain the blog, which sometimes was more stressful than relaxing. So, you know, I'm just gonna try to change my priorities and I hope that you stick with me. I would really miss you guys. I mean there's you know, I feel like I have made really real, you know, good at close friendships with a lot of you and um, even if you don't know my real name and um, you know I still just FYI all my comments are emailed to me so I will always get your comments and if there's something you need to say you can always just comment on whatever's up there and I will get that comment and you know that day and I will be able to comment back I still want to comment back um, you just, you know, I just, I'd rather be doing funnier, funnier stuff like I was before, rantier, you know, the real style that I really am, and um, less of this more, I don't know, mainstream version of myself. I just don't feel it. I'm not feeling it. So I gotta, I gotta either do this because I'm enjoying it and it's a creative outlet, and. I also really, honestly, this has really been the best experience of my life because I'm just a stay-at-home mom, you know, who sometimes doesn't leave the house for days on end. I know I've told you that, but it's the truth. It is the truth. I'm really, like, kind of a homebody. So to be able to have this experience where, like, I've made so much contact with adults on a daily basis and have a real conversation and... If sometimes it's about being a mom, but most of the it's not, and it's probably been the most, like, I don't know. It's just been such a rewarding experience for me as a person, not about whether I'm a wife or a mom or, you know, whatever else. So I do thank everybody very much um, for your participation in that. And um, you might also notice I have a really hard time getting to blogs, and I would really like to be able to visit you at your blogs.